You may wondering how I change the icon on my iOS 14 and here is the video how to change or add a custom icon when you are running on iOS 14. So for this one you have to follow some steps. So before you can change the icon on iOS 14, first of all you need to go to the App Store and then make sure you search for shortcut then you can download it is free from um, Apple and after that you need to download the icon or you can also place your own icon or your own image and even your own photo but for me I have the icon that I have created before so I also upload into Google Drive you can download from the link in my video description now I can just go to Safari here and this is the icon that I have created so you can just go to this link and click on download After that, you need to click on download here. You can see the download on the top. So you can click on this one. And then it will copy to file drive. And make sure you have um, iCloud drive turned on. And otherwise, it doesn't work. So to turn on iCloud drive, if you have one, you can just go back to setting. And after that, make sure you go to um, your iCloud here. And scroll down and click on iCloud here. And scroll down here. You're gonna find iCloud Drive. Make sure this option is turned on. Now let's go back to our files app. Now you're gonna see um, the file that we have just downloaded. So it is in zip file. You need to extract by click on it. Now the file is extract. Now you can go to the folder where you can have all um, of the icon that I have created here. Now I have um, created many icon like calculator, app store, and you can see by the name at the bottom. Now to change the icon, let's go back to the shortcut. Now go back to shortcuts app and then you can select on my shortcut. And if you have, um, if you first time install it, you're gonna see this page. So you can go to all shortcuts and then you're gonna find the plus button on the top. So I can click on plus and now you need to add accent and then you can click on scripting. And the accent that we want to do is open app. So you can select the app that you want to open. So I can just um, select this app. For example, I can select on, um, let's say I can select on find my here. So now after I have selected, I can click on the three dot on the top. Then you're gonna give it um, your shortcut name. Um, this is the name for the shortcut. So I'm gonna type find my, then click on done. And now click on add to home screen. And this is very important. It is a place where you can um, change or add a custom icon. Click on this one. Now you need to choose from file because we have just download the icon and we have download and put it in file. That's why we need to choose from file here. Now it's gonna pop up like that. You need to um, go all the way back. And now go to iCloud Drive, go to downloads, go to the folder folder that we have just created. Now I'm going to select on find my here and you're going to see the icon and then here is the name that it is going to appear on your home screen. So make sure you put it correctly and you can add your custom name as well. Um, you can add emoji or your custom name. It is depend on you, but I'm going to type find my here. Now click on add, then click on done. Click on done one more time. Now go back to your home screen. You're gonna find uh, find my here. It is the app that we have just created at the moment. Now when you click on it, it's gonna straight away jump into find my iPhone and you can see. And you can do the same thing on the other application like camera, phone, message, music, and so on. Just like I did um, here. And they are all of the app that I have uh, made it before. Like calculator, I can just open, then it will bring me to calculator. And one more thing that I want to mention, if you want um, a clear home screen, you can just um, clear all of these application. Um, do not delete it. You can just click on remove app and remove it from the home screen and then it will bring to app library. So don't worry about it. And like third party app like um, this one, I can just um, click on remove apps, but do not click on delete app, click on move to app library. So you can do it one by one until um, it is clear. And then all of your app will be appear here and the app that you have just changed the icon um, there is go you can organize here and you can see finally thanks for watching i hope this video it have you then we'll see you guys in the next one